Hey everyone, I'm in the upside down room at the Revo Spin Las Vegas location where they got all their photo booths set up so you can test out and try out new photo booth software. And today I'm going to show you a new iPad photo booth software. It's called Amaze Booth. And I think you're going to like it. Let's check it out. All right, everyone. So let's go ahead and jump into the Maze Booth app. I got Steven here. He's gonna help us uh, give a walkthrough of all the features and settings and how user-friendly this app really is. So right now, we have our home screen here. We have camera settings that can automatically adapt to your environment. The audio settings, which you can upload as many audio files as you want and select which one you would like for your event, as well as general settings to allow uploads on cellular data and to also save all photos and videos to your camera roll as well. But what I really want to touch on is the print server. So let's go ahead and take a look at this RX1 over here. We have already set up. So how this works right here is you actually connect your print server using a Windows device to your print server. So we have this Windows modem right here. As you can see, we already have a test print on there already. So how it works is basically when I take a photo from the iPad booth, it automatically, when I hit print, it will print, send the message to here and actually print out using this new printer cover we have here from RevoSpin as well. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that real quick. Let's go ahead and go into our event and actually go ahead and print a reprint right now so we don't waste your time. So as you guys can see, I got all my photos that I've been practicing with here in the showroom. Let's go ahead and do the one I took right before this video. Let's go ahead and hit print. Let's go ahead and go ahead and Microsoft it up to here. Nice, and what's this uh, model right here? This is an X9S 9-inch uh, with Windows 10. You can actually find this on Amazon for around $240, $250. And now oh, it's really fast. I have successfully received my print. Nice. So from iPad to here within, I would say, what was that about 10 seconds? Yeah, that was about 10, 15 seconds. That's really good. Um, and then if uh, they want a more in-depth tutorial on how to set this up right here, you made yeah. a tutorial video for that. Yeah, you guys can go ahead and head over to amazeboot.com or head over to our YouTube. We have a full print server tutorial on how to download the print server, remove the firewall, install the print server as well. So that is all in-depth on YouTube and available on our support page as well. And that just gets connected from here. Yeah, so right here, this is a wireless keyboard in case you aren't really handsy with the touchscreen. This is connected straight to the printer, and then this is the power cord right here. So, like I said, limited cords as well. Yeah, very easy setup with the RX1. Uh, and you try this on the Fuji as well, too? Yeah, we test this with the a Fujifilm AS300 as well. Um, so we actually have other settings because printers print at different specifications. So if you're looking to test with the RX1 or even a Fujifilm, definitely check out our support.amazebit.com for all of our recommended pixel dimensions and printer settings. Cool, let's go over uh, some of the stuff right here. So yeah. What, what can I do right here? So right here, this is gonna be your email button. So if you wanna enter in an email, you also have text option right here. QR code available to view on the online gallery. The check will go ahead and bring you back to the previous page. Um, one of the great features about Amazebooth is it already has a built-in gallery. All right, let's get into the subscriptions. So what do we have here? We have the Pro, Pro Plus, and I think we have the free. What, what's the difference on those? Yeah, so to start off for basic, Amazebooth is free to use, meaning if you want to test it out to see if you're comfortable with it, if it's worth the subscription, you're more than welcome to use it for free when you sign up for the app. Pro, you're going to get access to intro and outro videos, Branding on the web gallery to remove all the Amazebooth logos from your online gallery. You get access to thousands of photo booth templates already pre-made in the online web server, as well as also removing the ads and watermark. Now with Pro Plus, you get everything in Pro, but you get to actually collect data from your events, such as emails and phone numbers, phone downloads and total video downloads. So that can all be viewed from the online web server. So when you actually head over to mazeboot.com and log into your event, you're gonna be able to see these photo booth templates, create all your events as well. So that's gonna be definitely something you wanna check out on our support on Amazebooth on how to create an event and the web server tutorial. Awesome. And so for that uh, free, the free version, um, they're just going to get like a small little watermark on the images, right? Correct. Yeah. So it's a small little watermark. It shows up on the prints and the videos. So, but like I said, in order to at least test the functionality of the app to see if you find it user friendly, that is the goal by using a free version, just so you guys can test it out. I think that's a, that's a big plus right there. Having a free, because a lot of iPad 
uh, photo booth softwares are uh, pricing only. There's really no free um, that I can think of. Uh, so this is this is a really great option. You got at least three options to choose from. Yeah, so nothing is limited. Obviously, you won't have intro and outro videos on the free version, but the point is, is when you go to the app, you're able to take photos, take videos, take slow-mos and boomerangs, all that type of stuff at completely free to cost just to see if you like the app and how it performs. Yeah, which photo booth show is this? Yeah, so this is a Nimbus iPad photo booth, as you can see right here, uh, automatic LED lights, as well as also a remote in the back so you can actually turn it on, turn it off, and have it preset to colors if you want. And nice. also it has a ring light as well, so you guys actually can dim it and turn it bright to make sure you're capturing every aspect of the photo booth event. And I think uh, RevoSpin is gonna be offering uh, three months of the- Pro Plus, Pro that Plus. is correct, yeah. Three months of the Pro Plus if you purchase a iPad photo booth shell. If you guys like the way this one looks, it definitely looks super nice. And you can do a vinyl wrap on these as well too. Uh, you can use my discount code Richard5 to save 5% off. Uh, it's a really sleek model. And with this new cover, this new DMP cover, looks awesome because the, the previous one had a little lip coming out from the bottom and this is inside now so this is this is really nice and that's all on rewillspin.com awesome this has been great so if you have any more questions you can definitely check out the amaze booth uh, youtube channel where they're going to be coming out with uh, new videos and support articles on the support page um, but this is a great option. You know, you got your free. I think that's a huge plus compared to all the other photo booth software uh, iPad versions. And um, yeah, this has been great. Yeah, it's been great. Pleasure to meet you guys. And like I said, we'll have more content releases soon. So nice. stay tuned, guys. Yeah, let me know what you guys think about the, this, this software here. Take care.